Hi everyone, it's Melody, the nurse practitioner from Dr. Tammy's Healing Arts Centers, and I'm here today to talk to you about our regenerative medicine injections, especially in regards to insurance coverage. We get this question all the time, um, will my insurance cover this procedure? And most insurance plans, unfortunately, do not choose to cover this cost. Everybody wants to know why. I have my own personal theories as to why. My first theory is insurance companies base what they will pay for off of what Medicare and Medicaid do. Medicare and Medicaid, of course, are both government entities, so they're highly controlled by political contributions. Pharmaceutical companies make billions of dollars in political contributions every year to make sure that their medications are the ones that Medicare and Medicaid go with and that their procedures are the ones that Medicare and Medicaid go with, which in turn kind of trickles down to what your private insurance may or may not pay for. So when we think about the world of regenerative medicine injections, this is an injection that can improve your joint pain. So all of a sudden you don't need pain medication anymore. But if you think big picture, if you can move the way that you want to, not only is your joint pain gone, however, you also can get out there and exercise more, which means that your chance of hypertension or high blood pressure goes away. Your risk of diabetes goes down because you can be as active as you want to. Your risk of depression and anxiety goes down because you can go out and do all of those things that you normally would be able to do and that you want to do, you know, keeping up with your spouse or your kids or your grandkids in some cases even. So this is one quick, simple procedure with no downtime that means that you all of a sudden don't have to take all these pills every day for the rest of your life. So that's a lot of money out of the pharmaceutical company's pocket. Therefore, they don't really support this coming to the mainstream. I actually had a patient today that said, why aren't doctors shouting this from the rooftops if it works so well? And that's the main reason why. Um, it's mostly to do with insurance coverage and what's accessible to our patients. But another thing you need to think about, even if a surgery is covered by your insurance is all of the hidden costs and associated costs that would go along with that. You have to take time off work for a surgery, especially the day of, but usually for at least a couple of weeks afterwards while you're at home trying to recover from all of this. So you lose that time at work, which is income that you lose out on. Also the physical therapy that may be associated with it. You may have to take additional time off work to go do all of those things to retrain those muscles and structures that just got cut through and put back together to learn how to use these parts again. With surgery, there's also an increased risk of infection because it's far more invasive than just one injection. So you have that increase increased risk that you might set up an infection that can give you chronic long-term effects. You might have to be on antibiotics long-term. You might have to even go back into the hospital if it's severe enough. So there are a lot of hidden associated costs with surgery that even though you have insurance coverage might not cover all of those different costs and it certainly wouldn't compensate you for your time off of work or away from doing all of those wonderful activities that you love to do. So the benefits of these injections is, you know, it's quick, it's easy. It's an injection, there's no downtime. The function that you have coming into the clinic before the injection is pretty much the same as the function you'll have leaving. But once these cells start to do their job and start to help your body to heal itself using your own natural abilities, then you don't have to worry about the downtime. You don't have to take time off of work. You don't have to worry about going through some extensive rehab program because we haven't cut through all of your muscles and bones and whatnot. Um, so as far as recovery time, there's hardly any downtime at all. The only thing is possibly some injection site pain, like you're sore when you get your flu shot. You might be sore after you get one of these shots for a day or two. That's pretty much it. Um, other than that, it's just your body doing what your body is programmed to do to be able to rebuild and repair these structures without surgery. So... I know that it's disappointing for a lot of people that most insurance companies choose not to cover this. Um, we are working on this. We're collecting research to make sure that we can send it off to these insurance companies so that hopefully in the future that they will be able to cover this for you. But at this point in time, just consider the big picture when you're making your decision because we want you to make the best decision, not only for your health, but for your finances as well. So thanks for taking the time to watch this short little video. I hope you guys have a fantastic day and I wish you the best of health.